<laughs> Basically, this is Bibi. If Bibi was a boy, she would be this. <laughs> this is how we try to make her birthday as fun as possible, but on a budget. I don't know why we bothered putting so much effort into it. I know she's only two, she's probably not going to remember half of it. Um, my coffee's cold. <laughs> Just do this, having prepped so much in the morning. If there's one thing that Bibi's into right now that I really like, because it's gender neutral as well, is little dinosaurs. Ah, George's dinosaur and Peppa Pig. Dino paws. All these things. She's crazy about them. They're crazy in there. They're awesome. They're like her. Ah, baby. Um, I found a pack of these in multicolored ones in 99p shop, and they make for great cake decoration. Check this out. Uh, ah, cake. Ah, cake. And yeah. Just made a little cake like that. Beatrix! And that's just with some hand glittered stuff. It was really fun making it with her. Got this little guy climbing up the edge there. This little guy is climbing up the edge as well. These little guys are having a bit of a chat. Mwah! <gasps> Dinosaur breath. <laughs> Great little cake decorations that are cheap and colorful and there, you can play with them afterwards as well. And each of the kids can take one home. For great decoration, all you need is balloons. Lots of them. Balloons, 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 balloons. Just more balloons. They're colorful and cheap. Blow them up two days in advance and save yourself time on the day. We thought face painting would be fun, but just make sure you buy extra brushes because most packs only come with one brush. One of my old time favorites as a kid was pass the parcel. And it's so easy. Get a present in the middle, I wrap that one up, and then each layer I wrap in a separate thing. Now, it's either going to be, depending on the age of the kid, it's going to be like some glasses, some toy, and I generally like make sure that there's a suite with each one as well, just to make sure they love it. A little tip is to use three different um, paper colors so that you know which present's coming next if it's more um, age specific or more gender specific. I think what's so funny is that as a kid, you don't realize how rigged this game is, but obviously we're gonna, we've, list, we've made a list of all the presents inside and we're totally stopping the music when it gets to the right person. <laughs> so there's a reason why we're massive IKEA fans. Look at this storage solution. So each of these has got mainly B stuff, especially the lower row. And we're just going to take out the entire box. Soft toys, probably not the soft, soft toys because they'll just get really dirty and stained. Those are easier. So all the hard toys, are going to be much easier to wash. My husband had the great idea to put a spin on the coloring in station by sticking the sheets directly onto the window. Just so simple, but a little bit more fun. Oh, I'm colorful, gender neutral loot bags. I was just using an old shoe box, a little bit old crispy paper. These are really cheap at the 99p shop. And if I fill them up in advance, make sure there's still room for cake, but I always leave some spares just in case with a, a few extra bags in there in case kids show up. So what's inside the bags? Try and keep it simple. Everyone's got a little coloring book with some crayons and just an extra funny gift. Plus they'll have their dinosaur and the piece of cake to go in it. Um, and what they win from the pass the parcel for the older girls and boys with, instead of a, like a little toy, you're gonna give them like a deck of cards. And for the more grown up girls, maybe a little cute little compact mirror. You don't have time, you don't wanna buy your own sausage rolls, but this is a really fast cheat way of doing them. You just get your Gerta Frankfurters, they're great. Uh, puff pastry, pre-made as well. Come in, have a look. So you just, uh, what I've done is I've just cut it there, so that's the right size. I just roll it over, make sure it goes over a little bit. Cut it there. Done, sausage roll, and then we'll just cut them off. Then brush a little egg on top and stick them in the oven at 210 for 20 minutes. Ta-da! And really just to minimize stress, everything else was either raw or pre-made stuff. Nice and colorful. Just enough time for a cup of tea before the party. Mamá, ¿le gusta? Sí.
Well, it was always going to be hectic with little kids running all over the place. Good thing we stocked up the fridge with three bottles of Prosecco. Definitely the best tip yet. Happy birthday, my little B-Rex. You're a cheeky, bossy little monkey and we love you like that. Just don't grow up too fast. Guys, I hope you found this video helpful if you're planning your own little one's birthday party. If so, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you soon.